That's enough, you guys. Yes. Hi, guys. Oh, let me stop the dishwasher. Can you guys hear me okay? Hi, Julie. Making my, I made myself a cup of coffee because I hadn't had one yet. Hey, Andy. Okay, perfect. So I got all my stuff out and everything ready to cook with you guys and chat and ch all that fun stuff. Let me have a sip of coffee here because this will be my first sip. And then I'll show you the, um, <clears throat> I'll show you the puppies, of course, because the channel is about the puppies. I'm looking at the computer, so I'm sorry. You guys are here, not the computer. I should turn the computer a little bit and angle it. Let's see if that's in the way. Hey, love pugs. Good morning. Okay. Thank you, Steve. Hey, Andy, you got the shirt. That's awesome. I ordered like three or four things and I got my mat. Ah, hold up. I got my mat, but I'm still waiting for my mug. And what else am I waiting for? my sticker. I think I got a sticker, mug, and mat. Hi, Anne. All right, so let me show you the dogs the first. Because the channel is about the dogs. And let me tell you guys this little Jupiter she is a talker. Holy moly. All right, so we've got the boys, of course. Hey, Ann, thank you so much for being here. Pardon my ugly shoes, but I'm outside a lot. So I'm constantly putting shoes on. This little girl, Jupiter. Well, that's, that's not Jupiter. That, of course, is Ava. That's Jupiter, the little devil dog. Your puppy, though. So expected to be a devil dog, but she has a bladder as small as a fly, if um, flies even have bladders. No. So we got Jupiter, little cutie. Mm -hmm. Stop it. I don't have a toy next to me. Usually I put a toy in her mouth. Of course, Orion, Luna, Cosmo, you big old nose, handsome bud. She's such a talker. She was just sleeping too, you guys. So suddenly I start moving and she's talking like crazy. And we, of course, we got Ava. Boop, she just booped you guys. Jupiter, no. No, leave it. Hey, lucky dog. Thank you for coming on. I'm going to put the camera back up here. Sorry, you guys. What the heck just happened here? Guys, quiet. Can you guys hear and see me still pretty well? For some reason my screen went a little gray on me. Jupiter is a little bit of a bully right now. Yes, such joys. All right, I'm putting the phone back down. Hey, Jupiter! 
Knock it off, you're a shit starter. I'm not gonna get anything done if you're being naughty. Okay. Hi, Cynthia, thank you for coming on. Okay. I swear to goodness, five minutes ago, they were all passed out. I shouldn't have let them outside to go. Oops, I did not say that at all, Julie. Nope, those words did not come out of my mouth. Um, it's Wendy. Hey. It's windy and in the low 70s at the moment. Shh. Cut it out. No. All right. Five All right, sorry, that had to be done. Or I won't get anything done. Oh, oh Hindo and Rita's on. Thank you. Cynthia's here. Lena's here. Oh, I have so many friends on, you guys. Okay, well, let's put you down. And let's turn the AC on. Or cooler. Because it's getting warm in this house. Where you guys are probably turning the heat on. I'm turning the AC on to make it colder. I hope you feel better, Rita. I saw that you weren't feeling very well, so I hope you feel better. All right, so I haven't done a live with making treats before. I've done videos of making treats before, but I've never done a live. So this might be a little long one, so I understand if you can't stay on the whole time, but we appreciate everybody coming on and hanging out. And I'll explain everything while we go. You guys are awesome. Lost the AC. <laughs> Oh, hey, Harry. Harry's working today, but he's popping on saying hi to us. All right, so I found a recipe online. It looked really simple, so I'm gonna try giving this one, giving this one a go. And it just has peanut butter and pumpkin in it, it's main ingredients, and of course whole wheat flour, and a couple other things. So we'll go over everything together. Oh, Harry, thank you, love. I appreciate it. <laughs> he is, he's pretty special. Whew. You need to save that $50, because when we keep on cr cranking down the AC, we need something to pay for the AC bill. And I'm just teasing you guys. <laughs> Season. All right. So this recipe is super simple. I'm gonna heat the oven to 350. And this recipe only calls for about a um, quantity, I think, of like 25 cookies. I think it made so maybe about two dozen. So not a crazy amount. And if I walk away, I sorry guys, I'm just going to get things and because the little one keeps on tearing things off of certain areas. So I'm constantly trying to pick things up and take it out of her mouth. All right, so we preheated the oven. I hope you enjoy the the talkings from little Miss Jupiter here. Hi Nora, thank you for coming on. Really appreciate it. I need to make people moderators. Moderator. Handicap traveler, thank you for coming on. Shh, Jupiter, knock it off. Shh. Sorry, I missed your high up there. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I know, this is going to be really difficult for me to make cookies and to be able to keep the dogs under control. Oh gosh, tell me about it, Jupiter. 
Jupiter, what's going on? She does. When she's awake, she's a talker. Right now, I'm very much enjoying the times where she's actually sleeping. But she's very cute, though. All right, so we're going to do whole wheat flour. That's what the recipe calls for, but it's also much better than regular white flour for health-wise. And we're going to need two and a half cups of the flour. I'm going to try to keep the area nice and clean and put everything away when I'm done using it. Hey, Family Wilson. Thank you for coming on. Mission Impossible. You got it, Andy. <laughs> right now, she's chewing on something. Oh, nope. She's just licking the floor. Um, next we're going to do two eggs. festive is everybody getting ready for Christmas or anybody actually ready completely for Christmas I think me and Harry are done we have kind of a Christmas thing with my parents and Harry's family on Saturday because we are going out of town in the middle of next week before Christmas so we need to see all our family before we go out of town or we want to see all of our family before we go out of town all right so we have a half of a can of pumpkin I'm not half a can, half of a cup. great but it stains things easily um, let's see we then need to do two tablespoons of peanut butter Try not to say the P word anymore, but it might slip out. So I'm sorry about that, Family Wilson. I'm constantly looking over, making sure that she doesn't have anything in her mouth that's not supposed to be there. I don't have kids myself, but right now her stage, watching everything that she does, waving a knife around everything that she does it feels like on constant kid watch where she's going for down for naps then is a holy terror when she's awake i forget how long the stage is right i know both both of them, um, all of the dogs i don't know what jupiter but i assume she's very much very happy whenever she gets anything to eat but my dogs love both of them, so hopefully everybody will enjoy, enjoy this. And we are going to give these treats out to our, our neighbor friends. We'll keep a couple for our own, but we'll give most of these to our neighbors because we have lots of doggy friends in the neighborhood.
Oh, goodness, Cynthia. Yes. Have a good sleep. And thank you for coming on. And appreciate you liking the video and supporting us. All right. So that part's done. Oh, forever. They're in that stage. God, I hope not. All right. Next, I need... Just a little bit of salt. Hey, Lady Sadie. Give me one second. I'll make you moderator if you like. Um. Yeah, we have lots of doggy friends in the neighborhood, so we like to share with everybody. And we were just at the vet the other day and we took Jupiter and Luna, speak of the devil vet, Dr. Carloni is calling me my vet. Um, they, she always calls the next day to make sure the puppies are doing well after vaccines. But we took Jupiter and Luna the other day to the vet and somebody is a little overweight. So they should be getting cut back on their food. So we need to do a little bit more exercise. So we do a lot of exercise when we're on vacations. Thank you, Steve, appreciate it. We do a lot of um, exercise during vacation, but not as much. We'll do some frisbee and short little walks around the neighborhood, but we don't do a lot of long hikes. I just feel, unfortunately, it's pretty boring where we live for hiking trails uh, so I don't do a lot of hiking with enough exercise for doggy treats well we appreciate it if you guys like this I will definitely do more videos for making doggy treats and you guys can be entertained while me trying to keep all the dogs from being crazy with each other at the same time um, okay so from here it says, I got all the ingredients I need in here, so I just need to mix it. I have the cutest cookie cutters, too, so I can't wait to show them. Which you guys probably saw in the thumbnail, what cookie cutters I got. And if you guys are interested in the cookie cutters... Definitely, I have the name of where I got the cookie cutters from, and they have lots of lots of cool different options for different type of cookie cutters um, available for you to choose. So, and I got them off of Etsy is where I found them at. She might have, or he, I think it's a she though, I think she might have other places where you can buy them from, but I got them from Etsy. Mm -hmm. Right, exactly. So they said if this is not mixing the best, like combining really well, you can add a little bit of water until you get the right consistency. I'm making a mess a little bit here and I might get my hands into this in a moment. Yeah, we're going to get messy here. We're going to get our hands all up in this. Hey, Ben. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hope your morning is starting off well. I know it's still pretty early for you. Hope it goes well too. Right now we're just mixing the dough, getting it ready. Shelly, I haven't seen you put out your video yet this morning or maybe I missed it. Yeah, my pleasure. I'll, have to, I'll keep an eye out. I'm looking forward to your one for today. 
Thank you for keeping us up and running. All right, a little bit more water. I don't wanna make stuff too sticky. That won't be good. There goes my oven. Hey, no, don't chew that. Jupiter, no, leave it. No, leave it. really good and thank you for hanging out with us do anybody else make I know not everybody has dogs here but does anybody else make treats for their dogs regularly I don't make them regularly but on occasion I do maybe once every couple of months do you have a do you have a favorite um, doggy treat recipe if you have one and you have a link that you love, I wouldn't mind. I would appreciate if you put it in the link to the um, video and put a link in the comments for the video. I think I'm saying that right. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Jupiter, stop. No, leave it. Chewing the uh, edge of the cabinet. Everybody's right up my butt right now. All right, let's put some of this. All right. Whew. Oh, you know what? I was supposed to do this. There you go, um, Sadie. You are now a moderator. Yeah, this is a super easy one. I've seen some really interesting ones with like mint and parsley in them, but um, I didn't want to get that crazy with it. I know. <laughs> My words get so messed up. So if I say something like totally crazy, and it doesn't make sense. I'm sorry. That's just how my brain works. Things in my head don't always come out correctly out from my mouth. That's why I sometimes hate public speaking or doing lives because, yeah, I just get laughed at sometimes. All right. So... I needed to roll the dough out um, to a thickness about a half of an inch and then cut the pieces out. But before I do that, I know, I get tongue twisted so often. My <laughs> Harry, which um, Harry, um, which you saw earlier on the chat, he, he makes fun of me. He's like, Vanessa, why do you keep on that? I just, I don't know. It doesn't come from my head to my mouth out properly. baking sheet out so we can place our cup cookies on the baking sheet. Let's put some wax paper down. Broccoli's a good idea. Do you pre-cook the broccoli before you put it in the cookies or do you just leave the broccoli raw? I don't want wax paper. There we go. Wrong type of paper. Okay, you cook it until it goes tender. Hey, Jupiter, leave it. Oh, 
got a monster underfoot. playtime with the puppies. Okay, so we got our ball of dough. They said about a half inch. I feel like I got flour on my face. Okay. So thank goodness I did not do shoulders or back yesterday because this stuff is putting down some pressure to get this stuff rolled out. It was all legs yesterday. It was working out. They mix together at least with the flour and peanut butter. Oh, Naomi Wilson. I'll have to check that out. And guys, if you're not friends with people here, please, if you're interested, I know we have a lot of dog people here, check out their channels. If the content interests you, definitely give them a sub, watch one of their videos, like the video. Little girl's giving me a, the eyeballs on the other, watching me from afar. Don't worry, you'll have one of these as soon as I'm done baking them. They need a cool too, though. She's making little windy noises. Oh, pizza sounds good, especially homemade pizza. That's what I'm talking about, Steve. She's being a crybaby right now. She wants my attention so she can bite my fingers. We still need to do a bit more rolling. This smells really good. Oh, stop your crying. You're okay. I like that the dough's not sticking to the roller. good of course I'll have to do that again all right so I'll see if you guys she's Jupiter is now laying across my feet now she's moving because I just said her name okay so let's see if I bring this up close enough I got a wiggle butts a Australian Shepherd treat cutter I got a wolf and I got a doggy paw. So I haven't used these before. So let's see how they cut. Thank you, Sadie. I know, I'm gonna have to have my healthy food here in a moment too. 
For some reason, I think this is still too thick. A lot of concentration going on here, you guys. I'm trying to make sure it pops out correctly. Hmm, okay. I need a little bit of assistance. That is cute. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to pick that up. They're kind of large for treat size. So I'll probably end up just giving a couple out to each person because I don't think this will make as many treats as I thought it would. But isn't that cute how well that turned out? Okay. That's good. Make a couple more of that one. I know, Alina, right? So cute. They look like they're professionally done. We'll see how they turn out for a cook-wise, how professionally they look well after baking them. Let's do one more of that one and then we'll switch to another one. <clears throat> Don't you guys love the sound of silence? They're all sleeping right now. You guys probably don't mind it. Okay, so let's switch to the Australian Shepherd base. Which way are you? There, it is, this way. Sorry for the banging noise. There we go. Well, that one needs a little bit of help. Let's take that out. There we go. All right, guys, look at a load of this one. I think I needed to push it down a little bit harder by the ear area, but look at that. Very cute. Love it. I want total chaos. Is that what I want? Well, I put Cosmo in the bedroom because he was making too much noise earlier and I was worried that you guys couldn't hear me. So I see his fur on the underside of the door there. He's sleeping on the door waiting to come out. So I will let him out here shortly when I'm putting the cookies in the oven. All right, keep on moving, Vanessa. Let's try to do this a little bit faster. Oh, 
These are so cute, you guys. Anybody traveling during the holidays? And thank you, Alina. Yeah, it's, um, I guess we have like an L-shaped kind of kitchen. And Harry being the electrician, he made sure to add recessed lights, pendant lights, and then we have under counter lights too, which I don't have turned on. But it makes sure to keep the, the living, um, the kitchen area nice and, um, Nice and lit up, especially when we're cooking. It's super helpful. Oh, these are so adorable. Okay, let's do one more of the doggy face, and then we'll do some wolves. Winter camping? Where is that? Where do you like to do your winter camping at? We're doing camping, but our camping is more like glamping because we own an RV. And of course, you guys probably know that. So I call it camping, but it's technically not really camping. We've been there, done that. We don't want to sleep on the ground or air mattress anymore. Not saying there's anything wrong with that. We did it and we enjoyed it very much. Went to some really cool places that only allowed like tents. Do some wolves. Nice, Manly Wilson. Oh, that's cool. Let's try to get this one out. This looks a little bit harder to get out. Oh, that's cute, you guys. Oh, that's cool, a tent trailer. Look at the wolf. <laughs> oh, I'm really enjoying these cookie cutters. I might have to go on and get a couple more different ones. She had a couple, several different options for different type of styles. They don't easily come out of the cook. This one, at least this one does not come out easily of the cookie cutter. The paw and the, the dog face came out much easier. There we go. I have room for one more and then we have to re um, roll this out to get some more cookies out of there. Um, myself, um, so on my own with me and Harry, me and Harry have been together since I've been uh, 20 years old. So that's been, we've been together for like 22 years now. Uh, but so my first dog I got was when, right when I was with Harry, we had, we got a, a Pomeranian, her name was Heidi. So I was 20 years old when I first got my first dog. Yeah, I'll be turning 42 next week.
All right, let's put this all together and let's roll this out again. Whew, I am sweating, you guys. Still got a lot of dough here. I think going in, in into any trades is a fantastic line of work. So um, there is different type, type of trade school, but it's also amazing. If college isn't your thing, it's not the thing for everybody. Um, if college is not your thing and you can get like an apprenticeship or start as like a helper or some kind of trade and learn, I think it's great to be able to do any kind of trade. There's always going to be work for you. You just need the go out and get it kind of attitude the, to be able to get it done. But some reason, my husband, like with a, him and his brother own the company, they're having difficulty finding people to to work, to be just even to learn the trade. I don't know, whatever, that's a whole nother subject. Hey, good morning. Nice to meet you. Sorry, I'm right in the middle of rolling dough and I'm putting muscle into it. It's making me sweat a smidge here. And I'm drinking coffee, which is probably not helping the situation at all. Okay, we got that one rolled out. Let's start with some more um, paw prints and we'll go from there, get this done so we can get this in the oven and then have some, I know, me too, Sadie. I was waiting to have a cup while I did this. I should have had it beforehand so because this is making me sweat pretty good. Or put my hair on top of my head, but oh well. Okay. Cute. Man, I'm so happy with these cookie cutters. Sorry, you guys, I'm not talking all that much at the moment. I'm trying to get this done fast so we can move on to an, another fun part. Seeing the dog some more. Yeah, me too. I wonder if I can find more dog face. I wonder if they have a Bernice Mountain dog face. Hey, New York, thank you for coming on. Hope you're doing well. I'll show you here in a moment. I'm have these really cute um, um, dog um, cookie cutters here, and I'm making some dog treats. We're gonna have playtime here in a moment with the dogs as soon as I get these suckers in the oven. But here, I'll show you one. This is a really cute one. Sorry, I shake a lot. There you go. I 
I know. This is very cute. Thank you. Appreciate you guys hanging out with me. It's going to be kind of a long stream because of how long this is taking, but you know, whatever. It's all good. If you want to stay and hang out and help us out, that's, you know, appreciate it. But if you have, everybody have his life. So if you need to go do something, it's all good. Hopefully in the next 10 minutes here, I can get these in the oven and we can have some playtime. Wake up the little shark, to, um, shark monster. And have some playtime with her. And of course the Australian Shepherds. The Wiggle Butts. Thanks. We like having you guys here. This is a shirt I made a long time ago, but it's my YouTube shirt. I changed the title though. I took my out of there and just did Wiggle Butts Adventures instead of my Wiggle Butts Adventures because I didn't want them to think it was my butt Wiggle Butts Adventures. It was just Wiggle Butts Adventures. That's the, ah, I'm shaking. That's the wolf one. I can have maybe room for one more wolf and then I'll have to re-roll this out. Almost used up all the dough. Maybe I have enough for maybe two or three more cookies. We will find out here in a moment. Has anybody used any kind of like parsley or mint or anything like that to help with dog breath in their cookies before and actually noticed any kind of difference in their dog breath? And did the dogs like the treats that had that kind of flavoring in it? Yeah, I like the wolf. I think the dog face wolf in the paw print. I have some other paw print ones. No, I don't. Maybe. Hmm. Wait a second. I know I have dog bone ones, but I'm not going to use those this time. Oh, so the ingredients for this one is super simple. We did a super simple recipe, um, and it's just whole wheat flour, peanut butter, the P word. I'm going to say it though. Pumpkin. Um, eggs, salt, cinnamon, and a little bit of water just to make the dough more pliable. So very easy, super simple. I think this part right here is most definitely the most time consuming, is just rolling it out and cutting the cookies. It does take about 40 minutes to cook them, but I'll check on them sooner because I think I did them a little bit thinner than what the recipe called for. So I'll check them. I don't want to burn them or make them too crispy or too hard or burn them or anything like that. Dogs would not be happy if I didn't burn the treats on them. Um, let's do...
so cute. Um, let's do some, let's do some more woofs ones. See how many woofs I can fit in here. No woofs given. I know, I can't wait to start cooking them, you guys. Just like anything, like you put it in the oven, you can smell the scent of it. So this, I'll be able to smell the peanut butter and the pumpkin cooking. It's gonna smell so good in the house. table and Ava thinks somebody's at the front door trying to get her. Ava, it's okay. Shh. There's no delivery person. It's okay. Shh. Shh. No. No. Okay, Family Wilson. Sounds good. <laughs> yes, you're right. There is a lot of wolves given. What are you doing? Oh, right. Move. Ava, stop it. I'm not expecting any packages to be delivered today. And the mail person already came, so you're barking at nothing. probably get maybe one more cookie out of this if I re-roll this out. I don't want any of it to go to waste because that would just be denying one of our neighborhood puppy friends a cookie and that's not cool. Get as much cookies out of this as possible. Quiet Orion. That's a good one. Yep, they do. They give lots of wolves too. Alright, so I have a little bit left here. So I might be able to get one more cookie out of this. Or maybe two. We'll see. That was a good one. another paw print. There's nothing to growl at, bud. I'm going to try rolling this out. I don't know if this is enough to do a cookie. Maybe a wolf? Maybe. Shh. Ryan, stop it. Goodness gracious, you're being vocal, bud. Yeah, I'll show you guys here. I'm almost done. Let's see if I can get one more cookie out of this. See if I can get a wolf or part of a wolf out of this.
I'm kind of putting this together in pieces here, trying to make it long enough. I don't want anything to go to waste. I don't want to deny another dog a treat. Make out the most of what we have. There we go. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> Stop it. That, that sounded like somebody was at the front door there. I'm surprised they didn't go bark, barking crazy. Okay, let's show you guys what they look like on the tray. I think I did pretty good. That's all I had left over. Whew. Let me wash my hands because I am hot and I need to touch my hair. Thank you, Sadie, for being here. I appreciate it. We're going to get these in the oven here. But let me show you really fast what they look like. Get a little closer. It turned out so cute. All right, let's put these in the oven. So it says 40 minutes, but I think I made them smaller than a half inch thick. So I'm gonna set the timer for 25 minutes and check on them and see what they look like. All right guys, I'm gonna say the A word. So if you guys have an A in your house, make sure to mute me for a second because I don't want timers going off like crazy. Alexa, set timer for 25 minutes. All right, let me clean the countertop off and then we'll look at the doggies. I thought it was so funny when I did my lives um, at different, you know, before I was trying to get my watch hours and we'd talk to the A person quite a bit and they would turn the lights on and off in their house or turn um, like Pandora music on to a certain holiday station. That cracked me up. Oh. And here, that's the people also. I'll try to get closer. Also, I have it listed in the, um, whatever, the information area where I got the cookie cutters at, but that's what they are. And they give you a cute little recipe. It's not a dog friendly recipe, but for um, sugar cookies. All right, let's put this stuff away. Yes, thank you, the description. My words, I told you. I can think of them in my head, but I can't always say them properly. Coffee is cold right now, but it still tastes good. All righty. Oh, and then if anybody is interested, um, let's see what it says. Per serving, there is 56 calories, one gram of fat, zero saturated fat, 15 milligrams of cholesterol, 63 milligrams of sodium, 
total carbohydrates are nine grams, dietary fiber, two grams, 13, or not 13, three grams of protein and 73 milligrams of potassium. So it might be a little bit less because I made the cookies um, a little bit small, um, smaller. I'm trying to see where it says where how many cookies they say it suggested makes. Hmm, I don't know, but. And then once we take them out of the oven, they say to get them golden brown and crunchy in about 40 minutes to cool. So we'll see. All right. All right. Um, coffee without the ice, the cool coffee. So let me just make sure this all looks good. Let's turn this around so we'll have the watching the dogs. Thank you everybody for um, liking too. That's amazing. 22 likes. So I appreciate that greatly. Let's, all right guys, let's go see the dogs. I have to pull all cords up. We do not want cords to be eaten by puppies. All right, so she's sleepy and cute right now. Hi. You're always cute, no matter if you're feisty or not. Oh, that's a big yawn. I know, I know. Love, Bob. Cosmo, you checking out your twin? She's trying to give you kisses. He doesn't always like it. I don't know if they really love her right now. Hey, Andy. Um, but they are intolerant and have their good moments, but she's really feisty. And, oh, that's gross. Oh, Ryan, don't kiss me right in the mouth. That's gross. She's really feisty when she's awake, so she can be a little bit of a devil dog. And um, so, but she'll grow out of that. But I think she follow, follows around Cosmo quite a bit. I don't know if it's the coloring or what it is, but she likes following Cosmo in the yard. And he will play with her, but he's just so big compared to her that he kind of knocks her over and rolls her over. Yeah, she's testing her boundaries. Luna is actually, she's good with her, but Luna has put her in her place m multiple times. It's not hurt her, but it scared her quite a bit. Gave her a good old yelp. Didn't touch you. Just gave you a big snap right at you. She got got her scared, so she's definitely tested her um, boundaries. Oh my God, Alina, she is so cute right now at this stage. Well, she's starting to wake up though. Uh, Jupiter, let's go outside. Here, Jupiter, come on, let's go outside. At this point, I know that I need to bring her outside because she just woke up. I am going to take this off of Wi-Fi so I don't lose. She wakes up. Almost every time I take her outside, she goes potty. But we'll go out in the yard here and come on, let's go. So she had her first um, vaccines yesterday with us. So she had her beginning, you know, well, I don't know if it's her beginning one. Okay, Andy, thank you. Um, but she had starts of her Parvo. I think there's additional two more rounds of Parvo vaccines she needs to get. So I have been walking a little bit on the neighborhood, but not in the grass per se, maybe on the, on the concrete. Just you have to be so careful when they're so little and they're not fully vaccinated. Um, but what we're saying, oh, Alina, um, her hugs are so good and she still has the puppy breath 
and she loves to give kisses when she's all cuddly. It's so cute. And she lets you put her on her back and just hold her like a little baby. Oh, you're going to do a business? Come on, do a business. Yes, she's doing a business. Cosmo, leave her alone so she can do her business. Yay! Good girl, Jupiter. Good girl. Yeah, she still has it. I wonder how long she's going to keep the puppy breath for, but right now, oops, <laughs> thank you, Andy. <laughs> Both of them are doing their business right now. Let's try not to show the business part of the end. Good boy, Cosmo. You guys are always so generous, so thank you so much. Just appreciate you guys being on here, so it helps out greatly. Hitting that like button helps out so much. You still going, little girl? You all done? Hey, Harry. Thank you. The cookies are baking, Harry. So we'll check them out in about 20 minutes. Yes, puppy breath. Have you not smelled puppy breath before? Puppy breath is actually, it smells so different. It just, it, it's weird. It actually smells kind of good, I guess. I don't know. It just, just wants you to make you cuddle them even more. Stop eating grass. Yeah. Puppy breath. Puppy breath. Oh, she gets scared whenever the dogs bark out here and she usually runs to the back door. You're okay. We have people moving in the house over there, so Cosmo's letting me know that there's a stranger danger. Alright, let's go check out on the other dogs. Well, if you want to make a quick trip over here, Julie, you don't live too far away. Actually, we're going to be close to you next week. We're going to be in St. Augustine. I think, what's, today is a Thursday. So in one week we go, um, oh, what's that? In one week we'll be in the St. Augustine area. No, I, I Cosmo, be gentle. You bulldozer easily. Yeah, those puppy teeth are no fun. Yeah, it is a great yard. We have a pretty decent sized yard. We probably, I don't know how much we have actually fenced in, but we have a good amount fenced in. Jupiter. Lots of room back here for them to run. And we even go in the front yard with the, the girls especially when we play frisbee because I just feel like there's more room to throw across the yard without a fence in the way to play fr frisbee. Come on, let's go. Come on, Jupiter. Good girl. She's so clumsy. Come on. G ah, Cosmo. See, this is how he plays with her, but he ends up bulldozing her sometimes. Come on, Cosmo. Here, she follows. Come on, Cosmo. See, she's learned to stay down so he doesn't get her. Alright, let's go. We're going to have to pick you up. Come on, Cosmo. Yeah, grass doesn't taste good, does it? Let's go see the other wiggle butts. Let's go see the other wiggle butts. Ow, she's biting me. Shark is biting me. Okay, go get them. Yeah, he does that with sheep, too. Cosmo just like rams into. Nope, no, 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 no. Ah, ah, ah. Come on, nope. Not in the bedroom. Come on. Oh, come on. Move it. Move it. Come on. Ah, she's getting feisty. Come on. Come on. 
There we go. Oh, no. Yeah, you get your dolphin. There we go. You teach that dolphin some lessons. Look how happy they are. I know. After this, and after we feed Shirk, and I get lunch, we'll go out and play. Hey, Jupiter, no. Off. She wants to jump up on the couch so badly. Uh, off. Right now on a daily basis for the last, say last four, no, I haven't done a training session with her yet, but I've been doing sit and down and off with her. As you can tell, off is not the getting it that well, but um, she's kind of picking up on sit and down. It's starting to smell really good in the house right now. I know, I know. You're such a good girl, Ava. Oh, I see a pea spot. Okay, come on, let's clean this up. Somebody's got hiccups. Nope. Leave it. Constantly picking up, cleaning up urine. I just had you outside, but you still peed on the floor. Drop it. Drop it. Well, drop it then. Let's get some cleaner. Oh my God, you guys, this smells so good in here. Oh, that smells so good. Nope. No. Sorry guys, I just clean up the area where she did her little piddle. Okay, let's throw this away. Okay. Let's see. Orion, oh, be nice. He still lifts up his lip a little bit. He's not happy with her. Do you want to go outside, bud? Want some alone time? Oh, what? You want to go outside with them? I'm not going to allow that. You guys will go crazy out there. No, I'm not doing it, Ava. Uh uh. See, this is my mat, you guys, that I got. See the wiggle butts? I need to create some stuff in my shop um, of things with Jupiter's face on it as a puppy. Uh, we got Jupiter because Harry's wanted one for evers and ever. I know she's talking right now. And Harry's wanted one forever and then we conveniently found a breeder that was in Georgia and that did all the health certificates and going back in the parents and uh, showing all the records of like good health and like no cancers, all that kind of um, stuff, you know, that you want in a breeder that's very responsible. Uh, so, uh, uh, no, 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 little girl. Uh, so that's that. I mean, What's one more? That's what Harry's like. What's one one more, Vanessa? You're a stay-at-home dog mom. What's one more? Go ahead and get another one. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. 
I know. We're waiting for Orion to finish out there, and then I'll let you outside, little girl. But, um, so yeah, that's, you got one. Look how cute she is. Uh, and we talked to the vet, and she goes, they're a really good jo dog. Unfortunately, like, they're, because they're such a giant, they're such a large breed. That's her making that noise. They, um, they don't have as long as lifespans, and they do, she said the most common thing that they, they saw for the Bernice Mountain Dog is orthopedic issues, because of just their weight and their joints. Um, who am I calling? Orion, Orion here. Sorry if that's really loud, you guys. Orion, <whistles> there you are, bud. Okay, Ava, your turn. You know, it is cute. I love it. It says you can't put it in the washer. That you're supposed to only like pat dry it. I mean, pat clean it in spots, but. I'm going to try putting it in a gentle cycle before we go out of town and see what it looks like, what happens, and then just let it air dry. But the, because being at the back door, it is getting um, dirty and me going back and forth so frequently. Stop standing there. You asked to go outside, little girl. Go outside and go potty. Do it. You just want to stand, you want me to, oh, you want me to come out here with you? Okay, we'll, we'll go potty together. Come on. There we go. Goodness gracious. I have to hold their paw for everything. So we'll see. Hopefully um, it dries okay and it washes all right. But I have those available in the shop if anybody, not trying to sell anything. But if you like it and you want to just look at it, check it out, you can can't wait for my mug. I would have used my wiggle butt mug today. Oh, uh, I might have missed something I said or something you said. What the, that works for you? What works for me? Just the washing of the of the mat or coming out here to holding Ava's paw. Sometimes I have squirrel issues. Come on, Ava, do your business. Y'all done? Ava, here. Yeah, it actually does. When I come out here and tell them to go potty, it does actually work. Um, which dog was it? I'm pretty sure it was... Was it Luna? Um, Luna, she, she actually trained us when we told her to go potty. We'd give her a treat, and she would actually pretend to go potty outside just to get her treat. Maybe hence why she's overweight, but that's maybe, that was like four years ago. So I don't think that has anything to do about her current weight situ um, situation. But Ava does, Ava likes you to go outside with her. She, she really likes her to go outside with her. The other dogs will go out here and usually do their business all alone. But Ava likes to have, see, she keeps on looking over here at me making sure I'm here she likes she'd be outside she just likes being outside though in general though she'll just lay on the back patio just to sunbathe come on Ava here let's go Ava here come on see she's being naughty she'll come back to oh there she comes come on You're slowly making it to me. Ava, here. There we go. Good girl. All right, let's go inside. It's hot out here. It's Florida. It's hot. Oh. You need Go on, Luna. Do your business. You don't need me to hold your paw. That was very trustworthy of me leaving you in here all by yourself, little girl. So she, Jupiter, talking about that she, see all that white fluffy stuff down there?
need to watch her. She likes grabbing that stuff and taking off with it. But I haven't had a really a big issue with the actual Christmas tree. She hasn't been horrible with the Christmas tree. Occasionally she'll bite on the lower branches, but that's about it. What are you crying about? Hmm? I know. You're supposed to be daddy's girl. But I guess I'm home with you more often. So you're turning into a mama's girl. I know. Alexa, how much longer for timer? Only one minute left for 25 minutes. Luna bug. La bug. Yeah. She likes to do that. She just likes to lay right on the feet. No, you guys stay. Stay. Luna. Luna. You think that's the problem? If she would allow me to cuddle her when she's a little shark, she would get more cuddles. But when she's sleeping, I don't want to pick her up because it's so nice when she's just sleeping. Come on, Luna, here. Luna, here. Yeah, she has to do something, so she's staying out there. Oh, goodness. You came to join the window area? No, 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 you come back in. Well, you should come over here and just give her more cuddles. And have little shark bites to your fingertips. So I got shark teeth. See my shark teeth? Arr. Alexa, stop timer. All right, let's check on those cookies. No, you have to stay back. No. Okay, you guys, let's. Pull these out quickly so she doesn't burn her. No, nope, stay. Whoa, these things are sliding all over the place. I don't know to burn her nose goodness that was look at all they all slid all over the place i think she's demanding a cookie okay these are perfect yeah they're nice and nice and hard nice golden brown they look about the same color but i think they're done because i made them thinner Let's get a cookie baking sheet out. I mean, a cooling sheet out. And I don't know where I put those. It's been a while since I've done cookies because of the darn diet that I'm on. Or not really a diet, but there they are. Sorry about that craziness. Okay. Get my cooling rack out. And then let's put these babies on here to cool. We'll be able to walk around the neighborhood a little bit later on today and pass out our fun treats to everybody. I'm feeling kind of good right now. I might make some human treats too to go along with it to give their their human counterparts some treats also. Whoops, I just threw a doggy face. Sorry about that puppy. Ow. I suggest using a spatula doing this. Not your fingertips. Super duper 
hot, picking them up. Let's turn the oven off. There we go. It's hot enough in the house. We don't need to keep that going. There we go, you guys. Look at the puppy treats. So that's our cool um, peanut butter and pumpkin. Sorry, Family Wilson, if you're still on. Um, a cooling rack. Um, this is our treats here, pumpkin and peanut butter treats. Let's let love bug in and say a final goodbye to the puppies, but I appreciate you all coming on. Oh, I can't wait to share these. Okay, let's let love bug in. Oh, she's being good. She's chewing on one of the toys. I mean, technically, we could eat these. I mean, because everything in there is edible for humans. Luna, come on, let's go inside. Luna, come on. So I would love to be able to let you guys see them snack on them, but maybe I'll do a quick little short of that later on. Maybe tomorrow we'll put out a short of them snacking on the new puppy um, treats, but uh, leave it. See, no, leave it. But um, they're too warm at the moment to be able to give them. Oh, you guys are so cute. Um, I do have a premiere coming out later on today. It's at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, ouch, that hurt, of Jupiter's first 24 hours um, here with the wiggle butt. So I hope everybody is able to join and watch that. Thank you, Anne. Thank you, Nora, for staying on and hanging out. So if you guys can join us for that, that's awesome. If you can, I understand, but it's not a long video. It'll be, I think, less than 10 minutes it is. She's nibbling on my pants and actually biting through the, and getting my leg off. Stop it. It's a little shark. No problem. But thank you everybody for joining. I hope you enjoyed those that recipe. And if you have any questions, you can definitely leave it in the comments. Mm -hmm. And sounds like Cosmo's giving a goodbye to Jupiter. That's funny. All right, you guys, have a wonderful rest of your day. The boys, everybody's signing off with a bunch of wolves given. And we will talk to you later. Bunches of loves. Appreciate the support.